Hey Alexis Love Beauties and Flawless Men, let's get into this $65 grocery haul. So I went to Gordon's and got this big bag of spinach for only $6. The thing I love about Gordon's is I honestly forgot about them, but I'm over Walmart, over Kroger, cause their food has been going really quick. One time I had spinach from Gordon's and it lasted in my refrigerator for almost two months. Absolutely no lie. No lie. Then I put the spinach in the freezer and started using it for like smoothies and stuff. I literally had the spinach for a year. I don't know if it was doing too much, but that's how healthy it stayed. I was super excited to go in there again and get this big bag of spinach, honey. And then I had got this bag of spring mix as well. I love it cause it's already washed. And this bag was $3. Then we went to get some fruits. We have some dragon fruit here. And then also I was speaking with the young lady. She was like, oh, you should try the yellow kind. It's really, really good. I never seen the yellow kind, but this is a dragon fruit, a passion fruit as well. So I'm gonna try this. Passion fruits are really, really good for everything. Literally everything. To cleanse the blood is the number one good thing of these then we have some mangoes from brazil those mangoes were like too big so i tried to find something that looked regular i don't like my food being over big then i got some black plums and i also had got this small baby spaghetti squash she loves spaghetti squash then i got these i usually do these with like a pesto i couldn't find a pesto in none of the stores i went to so oh excuse me i'm gonna be making my own sauce we'll figure it out honey we'll figure it out and then I just got like a few like vegetable blends and that was it. Then I went to the dollar store, got me a snack. I cook with coconut oil now. And then I was gonna be using the olive oil for some salads, but they didn't have like olive oil. Uh, they had this soy blend mix. So I was like, I'll just get one of them. The thing about soy is that soy absorbs hydration and nutrients in the body like that tofu it's all right but after so long now this is what dr sebi said and i'm rocking with him because it makes sense because i had tofu and it was really dry so eating tofu all the time or eating soy all the time is not good i really didn't like the fact that it has soy mixed in here but a lot of stuff have soy and vegetable oil and that's not really good for you like that i got some barbecue sauce because i did want like some boneless chicken wings and i have some konya mix so this is like a blend of konya red white mullet buckwheat and then also i seen this barley i have not seen barley in a grocery store what i learned about barley the reason i bought this was because i learned about beer beer is made up of grains and plants so barley is one of those grains that they use in beer they use hops in beer hops is the plant that gives beer the bitter taste and they use a few different grains in beer um a lot of like drugs and you know liquors and stuff is made out of plants but don't take this out of content take this wisdom a lot of our like drugs and stuff is made out of plants but the way that we use them, we abuse it. So I'm not saying, you know, go do something wild, but I just learned about that. So when I seen this, I was like, let me get some barley because it really is a grain. Um, and they just use a lot of grains and fruits and vegetables and ferment them. And the way that they're processed is why we get liquor and different things like that. So I wanted to try barley as well. Um, I did get a small prune juice and I also got some organic chicken, organic chicken breast. And that is really it. And then I also have this bowl of peanut mix. It's some walnuts, raisins, peanuts, cashews, M&Ms, just a whole bunch of peanut mixes in there, honey. So what we're focusing on trying to do is just eat like twice a day, learning about like intermittent fasting, um, just to, you know, train myself. I've been doing that for like a few weeks and it's been working tremendously. I haven't really been that hungry, just eating twice a day. So this time I was like, well, let's just get some things that you know, some small things that we can meal prep. I usually eat this good anyway, but it's just about the overeating. So now we're trying to, whether I'm eating healthy or not, just do it like two times a day, which been going really good. So we're going to keep up with that. And guess what I found in the store? Y'all will never believe what I found in the store. Yes, honey, this is white asparagus. That's right. I just learned about white asparagus probably about a month ago on the food channel on YouTube. Um, Hmm, what is that food channel name? 
insider food thank you lord so the insider food channel on youtube i was watching that and seeing white asparagus this is a luxury like in our country we can get this i got it like for three dollars for this pound you barely probably will ever see these um these are in season as well it's just the way that they go about pulling them up so they pull these before they get in contact with the sun our sun is full of chlorophyll and that's what turns our vegetables green this is why it's so important for us to eat our vegetables because our vegetables get their nutrients and minerals and vitamins and trace minerals and different things from the sun so that's why it's important to eat foods that have been planted they pull these before they get in contact with the sun and this is why they are white um, when you see the little purple head at that's because they were going to start turning green so they pulled these before they got in contact with the sun same benefits um, and other countries I've seen that they're like 10 times bigger and that's still normal um, but I heard they have like a really sweet taste so I'm gonna cook these I'm gonna bake them I don't even want to season them for my first time trying them I'm gonna try them raw I'm gonna cook them with some I'm gonna cook them in glass I'm gonna cook them with some coconut oil and just eat them raw and see how they are i got these from myers i do not know if i'll ever see these again in this city but i had to get them because i learned about them so it is super important to learn about food so when you see them you're you know i don't think it's weird like this you know it's the same thing of this but it's just a different color you know probably pulled in a different season a different location but it's still the same thing so i just wanted to show you a nice healthy grocery haul for 65 dollars. i went to myers i got the chicken from walmart i went to the dollar tree got my oils and that was pretty much it as for dinner i'm all over the place like i wanted some boneless chicken wings with a little salad but then i was like oh i want some of this and i want to i want to eat this white asparagus before it goes bad like i want it now so for dinner i'm thinking about doing this um cooking down some tomatoes because you know we make our own tomato sauce now um i do have some tomatoes so i'm thinking about doing this cooking it down with some tomato sauce some spinach a side of asparagus maybe a few sides of like roasted chicken or grilled chicken and that honestly look good to me i ain't gonna lie i still kind of want the salad though <laughs> still kind of want the salad and that's pretty much going to be it i'm not going to lie i'm probably going to try a half of this as well i had like some peanuts earlier and like a small meal but i'm about to get ready to enjoy this last meal so i can enjoy my night thank you so much for stopping by thank you so much for learning about your health do your extended research so when you are in the store you can make healthier decisions it is a process but it can be done and god bless you alexis loves you Mwah.